nice sunny day like today to do laundry. I use a bit of power doing this and uh, the sun will replenish my batteries. I'll be at 100% at evening time when the sun goes down. So I'm going to show everybody how I do laundry off grid out here in the middle of nowhere. Got a little washing machine, you got the wash machine side, and you have the spin dry side. And this is the drain tube, which I just put in a bucket. When the bucket fills up, I empty it outside. So you can't put a lot of clothes in there. I usually just a you know, small handful, maybe two pairs of pants at the most. Uh, if you were going to put jeans in there, I would just do uh, one pair of jeans. But I don't wear jeans, so. A little bit of soap in there. Use a lot less soap than you normally would on a full size washing machine. And it usually takes about five gallons to fill it up. Three switches on top. You have the wash timer. That's 15 minutes. It's a little pulse. It'll spin it around, then it'll go the opposite direction, then turn around and go back the opposite direction for 15 minutes. The second switch is to drain the wash tub. The knob over here is for the spin side. So it has a water inlet for both the wash tub and the spin side if you wanted to you could hook up a hose and while the clothes are spinning you could add water and that would drain out automatically the wash basin side you have to move the center knob to the drain position to empty the water out of that one but i don't use these out here i just use seven gallon water jugs So now we'll just hit the drain. Dump the bucket outside and I'll be right back. We'll fill it back up for the rinse cycle. Now do another 15 minutes. So the rinse cycle is done. Go ahead and pump that water out into the bucket. Okay, I can start putting some uh, laundry over into the spin side. So you'll place this uh, plate inside the spin side press it down set it for five minutes and that'll be basically dry almost by the time it comes out of there as it's spinning around the water is uh, just gravity fed into the bucket
So for a size comparison, I just stuck a boot on top of the washing machine. Give you an idea how big the thing is. So this cabinet is where I store the washing machine and the drying rack so it stays out of the way. Here's the drying rack that I use. And it sets up very easily. Some little rubber bands that go over the ends. I set this in front of the wood stove. That's how I dry my clothes. So per wash load, I usually spin maybe two or three times uh, with items. Put a couple in there and press this, this plate down on top of them, squeeze out a little bit of the water, and set it on five minutes on the timer, and uh, they'll be almost dry by the time they come out. My under sink bucket's double for uh, dirty laundry water.